Hey guys, it's Kelty and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, as you guys know, my last video, I did a like productive morning routine. But in this video, I had to, I kind of felt like I had to do it right after each other. I'm gonna be doing my productive night routine. So I had such a productive day, you guys. Don't worry, I'm gonna be transferring to the vlog camera soon. I just wanted to vlog on my phone. It's currently like 6.55. I, we've already finished having dinner. I'm gonna tell you a little bit about my day later, but subscribe, enjoy this night routine. So yeah, let's just get started with the vlog. Okay, how we're gonna start this vlog is I haven't left yet, but I'm currently upstairs in my grandma and grandpa's apartment where my parents are staying. And I'm just chilling on the couch. We had such a good dinner. We kind of celebrated my birthday. If you guys know, my birthday is actually in February, but I never got to celebrate it with my grandparents. So I just pick a random day and I chose dinner tonight. And so they sang to me, I chose Giordano's, no, DiGiorno's pizza, like the frozen one in like Target or Harris Teeter. Literally the best pizza ever. I can't even explain. It's just so good. Papa John's is better in my opinion, but it was still amazing. Um, And then I always, like six out of the seven nights of like every single week I spend at my grandparents' house. I love to end off the night with a bowl of ice cream. Not a huge one. I don't know. It was super good. I'm gonna go downstairs and tell you guys the flavors that I like. But right now I'm just chilling. I have nothing to do. It's been such a productive day. I'm going to tell you guys about that later, as you guys know. So I'm just watching some YouTube, and if you guys know this YouTuber, she is Kenna Marie. I really, really love her videos. They're long, aesthetic, really well, like, edited, I guess. And yeah, I love watching her YouTube videos and watching her get her life together, like, everything like that. And it's just, like, really motivating and inspiring me to get on a productive grind. So I will see you guys later. <laughs> plans have changed my sister and i are going out we're gonna go to the store safeway and get some ice cream kirney wants some ice cream and we don't and my grandparents don't have the flavor she wants so i'm gonna try this oh i dropped the key so i'm gonna be driving this and i'm so excited i haven't vlogged me driving without my parents on my youtube channel or on any youtube channel actually I'm so excited. I need to call my grandma just so she knows what's up. And guys, look. I love this feature um, on my grandma's Tesla. I can like customize this color. So look, look at that. Isn't that so cool? She is coming. I will see you guys at the store. Also, what I want to do is you go to Toy Box and Rainbow Road. I really want to do this. So then when I drive, it's rainbow. I'm so excited. Basically, if you guys have stayed updated, um, I have not driven at all since i've gotten my driver's license alone 100 percent alone by myself and i'm not allowed to drive at night but it's currently 7 18 p.m it's still like it's starting to turn dusk outside but i love driving with kirani just like the two of us it's so much fun i'm currently waiting for her she's getting shoes but i am definitely i just feel like i've had there's th some type i can't pinpoint it but there's some type of big change that i felt ever since i got my driver's license and i kind of feel more mature more confident more comfortable um even though it's like driving right before i got my license compared to driving right after like on the same day compared to driving after i got my license i just felt immediately different i felt more trustworthy i feel like i've had so many months of experience in that like few hours but obviously it's not true but i just wanted to tell you guys comment if you guys have gotten your driver's license what it's felt like right after you got your driver's license because i want to know if i'm not the only one that's felt something kind of like that but i'm gonna drive us i'm so so excited and i will see you guys at safeway i'm so excited to drive my little sister around and her friend is also really excited for me to drive them around i love that there's not many homeless people Okay, we made it to Safeway. It was like a two second drive. I'm gonna get Kenny some ice cream and we're also looking for something else. Look at these fall pumpkins. So cute. I'm so excited for fall. Okay guys, I'm home from the store. I'm gonna do, well actually I can't really do a little haul because we only got like two things. We got some dressing for my grandma and then some mint chip ice cream for my sister, but we are back home in my cozy little bedroom. I literally love every bit of it. I have the Galaxy on right now. This is my new Galaxy light. If you guys know from my TikTok, I did a little Amazon unboxing, but oh my goodness, it's so pretty. 
we have to get dressed and like ready for bed chill kind of vibes it's currently 7 54 and i kind of get in bed around like 8 30 8 45 which is really really weird unless we're like all watching a family movie and we stay up until like 9 30 but i'm in my room i'm in don't mind the stain it's literally olive oil from cooking dinner but i have this little south carolina t-shirt on and then some adidas like running shorts and i want to get comfy so let's pick out an outfit so in this drawer i keep all of my tops and pajama tops this has been my go-to one lately it's just this plain yellow oversized one. It's actually my dad's old t-shirt. It is the most basic, cotton, comfortable t-shirt ever known to exist. I love wearing it. And then honestly, from this matching silk set that I got on my 16th birthday, like pajama set, I like wearing the shorts because they're like nice, light uh, to wear. So we're gonna get dressed into my pajamas and I will see you guys next. Okay, we've made it to my bathroom. You guys might know that this setup from my TikTok, I do a bunch of get ready with me's here and stuff. But now I'm gonna get kinda like ready for bed. I'm gonna do my skincare, wash my face, take out my jewelry, just get ready for the night and bring you guys along to what, honestly, I have this same exact routine every single night and I like having a routine. So let's just get started. First up, I'm gonna take out my earrings. I love, I feel like I always have to have jewelry on at like all times. Jewelry is out. Then I like to tie my hair, but right now I can't find a hair tie like any other girl on this planet. I don't know where they all go. I literally put them in the exact same place every single day, but I have these two little Amazon clips. They're the rose gold ones from the pack of silver, gold, rose gold, and black. You guys also know them from my Get Ready With Me's. So this is like the perfect little skincare moment. Yeah, so I'm gonna start by washing my face. Okay, washing my face is done. That's literally the best part of every single day. Just getting all my makeup off. Okay, literally, why does it look like I have a stain? I just got water on my t-shirt. You know what? It's fine. So if you don't already know me by now, in every single one of my YouTube videos, I use the giant, what is this called? The container of Cetaphil Moisturizer. Literally obsessed with this thing. Use it every day and night. It's the thickest, creamiest, moisturizing, hydrating moisturizer you will ever get. And no, this is not an ad. I wish it could be. Please, Cetaphil, sponsor me. I've shown it in every single one of my, like, get ready with me TikToks. Like, it kind of, if you're not having the best skincare day, definitely recommend this product. Product. Also, it's for sensitive skin just because it like blurs all of your lines or if you're not having the best skin Texture wise that day it literally makes you look like you have a filter on but it's not tinted. It's no makeup It's just so good and it makes you look so glossy and glowy and like clean girl aesthetic So that's the only product I use on my face Sometimes I still don't know if I break out to this or not, but it's the Mary Kay, like the mini one, the Mary Kay Time Wise Replenishing Serum C plus E. It's the cutest little thing. I'm just gonna try it on for you guys. I do two little pumps. You guys have probably seen this on my TikTok as well. I do six little pumps and I spread it everywhere. This is just like anti-aging, kind of like keeping your skin smooth and all one texture, if you guys know what I mean. I don't know, I just love having so many skincare products, but I found what works the best for me is only using like just one simple moisturizer and it makes my skin the best it's ever been. So like right now I can tell you it's a little bit of a burning sensation already. So I don't think I'm gonna get the big size of this, but it was fun to try out and it hasn't broken me out that bad. So we're gonna wake up in the morning and see if my skin is doing well. Um, I will put in my tainers, but I'm not gonna put them in yet. I put them in kind of sort of right before I go to bed. And then I just had this little thing of Aquaphor. Yeah, that's basically it. I have the most simple skincare ever but my sister gave me literally so many of these like crest 3d whitening strips and i've used two or three of them yeah i've used three of these so far and she just had all of these and she never used them so i'm gonna get my teeth so white i'm just so excited and weird thing i've been eating one like medium large size carrot every single day for the past four days i want to get my skin a little shade warmer 
and not look so pale without having to put makeup on. So I'm gonna do that for like two to three weeks. And I'm also gonna whiten my teeth so I have a natural tan. Let's see if that works. I will update you guys on that. Matching my shirt tonight is the Soda de Nero Brazilian Boom Boom Cream. I really don't know how to pronounce that, you guys. So I just used a little bit just to smell good. I don't have a perfume and I always put it on my arms, my neck. Also just to keep staying a little bit moisturized and look a little bit glowy. So I love this mini thing. And it smells like salted caramel popcorn plus coconut, I think is the best way I would describe the scent. And we're all ready for bed. I'm gonna take out these clips. And we're gonna go chill in bed and watch some YouTube. I wish I would have vlogged more like of my night, but honestly, after dinner, this is kind of what I've done. I've brought you through everything I've done. I did want to tell you guys about my day, like my really productive day that I had today. Let's go into my room. Okay, I'm gonna kind of set you guys up right here. I have really good lighting because on my little, I'm literally on my knees. It's the best lighting with this, and then I have this little like candle light, so. We're just gonna work with what we have. So basically, um, this morning I woke up at 7.30 a.m. I woke up, got ready, made my bed, really productive. Then I filmed my content for the day. And then I did like 45 minutes of math. I don't want to explain it. I'm just getting ahead next year's math. So I did that. I'm starting to do a little bit every single day. And then I went upstairs to go play a game with my sister, Farkle. If you guys know that, I really, really love playing it. It's a perfect two-person game. We worked on a puzzle, so no technology there and then throughout the day i posted on social media tiktok and instagram but that was like really really short after the puzzle we did a little bit of hamlet we are reading the book with my grandma or the play we're reading the play whatever it's called we went and doing some questions just to stay in our english grind and then we took a big lunch break then kirni and i started working my grandpa had some jobs for kirni and i to do so we stayed busy with that and my back hurts so bad you guys you don't even know from bending over we were power washing the driveway and the front porch, but we had to first scrub it and then it took hours to power wash. Like I didn't even know it took hours, but it took hours to power wash and my back really hurts from bending over so much. But then we had my little birthday dinner, really good pizza. And salad. I still showed you guys the rest of my night. So I had a really good productive day today. No like main form of workout, but it's okay. It was an active rest day from my work that I did. But yeah, so that was my day. I'm going to normally around this time. It's 8:10 right now. Normally around this time, I would either go up, see if my parents or grandparents are watching a movie, and I would either watch that with them if it's a good one, or I would stay down here, either edit a YouTube video, which I don't. I have a bunch scheduled and I'm filming one right now. Then I just scroll on pinterest get some ideas save some tiktoks for filming like the next day think about what i'm gonna do the next day because i don't have a set schedule every day or just like watch some tiktok catch up on youtube videos that kind of thing that's what i'm gonna do and yeah it's the next step in my night routine i actually just turned on this light right here because um my phone is almost dead so i need to plug this in but i'm going to edit a youtube video like I'm actually going to edit this YouTube video right now as something productive to do so I can have it already, probably trying to edit most of it. So I'm gonna go upstairs to my dad's computer and edit this YouTube video. <laughs> guys i think this is where i'm going to end off my productive night routine thank you all so much for joining me if you've made it to the end of the video it's currently 9 12 p.m and right now um i just finished editing this whole youtube video which i'm actually very proud of myself for that but i'm going to chill on my phone do a little bit of admin work respond to emails watch some tiktoks and this is honestly how i spend the rest of my night just like chilling in bed it's like the best feeling ever so relaxing and yeah i'm already for bed and i so from kaya's school liberty i got at like the little gift shop this little thing stuffed animal it's like their mascot eagle signed by kaya the one and only and i sleep with it every single night and it just reminds me of her and it's super special but anyways i'm going to go to bed and i will see you guys in my next video bye